in Italy, and we've recorded this like so many times because we just keep messing up, but we're literally just going to go over what we did in Switzerland because we didn't record much at all. Um, like at least we didn't talk in the, vi- in the videos we made. So you're going to hear our voice while we just flip through these clips and yes, let's begin. <laughs> okay, so the day after we left or we arrived in Zurich, we ended up going to Rappersville, which is one of the towns on Lake Zurich. And there we kind of just walked around. We saw some rose gardens, an old church, and we found this local swimming spot just by chance. Everyone was in the water and laying on the floating docks and it was free, which was a bonus. And we cooled down there for the morning. Just had a great time. We um, took the ferry back, uh, which was quite a long ride. Mm-hmm. But when we got back to to Zurich, we um, got some food, got some wine, and you're allowed to like just drink out in public there. So we went to this park, and everyone was there like drinking and smoking and stuff, and just like. Um... I think it was a Saturday too, so everyone was just out enjoying mm-hmm. enjoying nature. Yeah, right by the water, so it was cool. We didn't eat out at all in Switzerland yeah, because it was too expensive. Yeah, the entrees were like equivalent to 60 or 70 it was Canadian like dollars. really expensive so yeah so this became our kind of trend we just ate out apart. at like grocery stores and like just like like bread lots of bread <laughs> bread and like pepperoni sticks mm-hmm. <laughs> for me she doesn't eat pepperoni <laughs> so anyways let's continue on okay so then we eventually left Zurich after two days and we ended up going to Interlaken and I think this was my highlight of Switzerland so the first night we didn't really know what to do again and we ended up just looking up lakes close by and we found Lake Breens I think is how you say it so I have a clip of what it looked like when we arrived in Honestly, we were just in awe. Like, I don't think I've ever seen a lake this beautiful before with all the mountains around it. So we rented some paddle boards. That now we are obsessed with paddle boarding and yeah, we want to buy fun. some. Yeah. And we just watched the sunset, paddled on the water, got back to our Airbnb, mm-hmm. probably stopped at a grocery store. Yeah. And then <laughs> later on, we got like a day after we went to... Lauterbrunnen, mm-hmm. and that's when we we went up to the top of the Stillhorn, mm-hmm. and um, it was pretty cool. It was like one of the James Bond films was made there. And this mountain gives you a view of the Jungfrau. That's what I'm explaining right now. Monkt, and I forget the third one, <laughs> but yeah. that's what I was showing. Yeah. And then we flipped the camera and we showed. Uh, Stillhorn. And now we're at the top. Yeah, it was uh, pretty pretty cool up there. Mm-hmm. I, I think it wasn't as high as Haleakala when we were in Hawaii, mm-hmm. which we actually drove to the top of that. That was pretty fun. That's mm-hmm. another trip that we did. But um, yeah, it was just us up there, freezing. It was chilly. Mm-hmm. But uh, it was definitely like a really cool view. So the two towns that we went to from Interlaken were Lauterbrunnen and the next day we went to Grindelwald. And we got to Grindelwald and I think a lot of people go there to go up the Jungfrau, which is like the top of Europe. But we had already gone up the mountain so we didn't know exactly what to do. So we ended up hiking while we took a gondola again. Took a gondola. um, Up just a little bit and we ended up doing an activity there and then hiking down Mm -hmm. and this was this was a really nice hike i think we talked in some of this footage i mean just look at this view it doesn't even get any better than this snake where right there sorry for that mild interruption i have a deep-rooted fear in snakes so jeffrey scared me but we made it off of the trail and we are 
walking on roads now. Still haven't made it back. Maybe should have taken that down. I mean, it is pretty spectacular though. It was uh, a cool little hike. It looks easy from the bottom and from the top, but from the middle, you realize it's not as easy as it looks. Mm -hmm. So we found that walking backwards actually helped. So Julia, Julia was walking backwards and just like embarrassing me. <laughs> I didn't really want to be seen with her because she just looked silly, but. <laughs> the end of our time in Switzerland. We yep. were there a little less than a week and we just got to Italy now. So hopefully you enjoyed that. Yeah, thanks for watching. Okay, hopefully good. our future children will like